In this video, I'm going to teach you how to fix Cloudflare error on Android. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Cloudflare errors on an Android device can be annoying. They often prevent you from accessing a specific website or application. Usually, the error will be on the website's server side. So, there are some things that you can do to check, but sometimes you will simply have to wait until the website or the app that you are trying to access fixes the issue on their end. To be absolutely sure, you can start by visiting a specific website. If you visit down for everyone or just me.com, you can input a specific website or service application and they will tell you if it is down for just you trying to access it or for everyone. If you notice that it is indeed down for everyone, this means that the problem is on their end and you don't have to do anything because you simply have to wait until they figure out the problem and fix it. Alternatively, if you are sure that the problem is on your end, then one of the things that you can do is to refresh the page. You can try doing this multiple times. Reopen the application, refresh the page. Next, clear the browser data. So, I am using Firefox, but of course you can do the exact same thing on Chrome. You just go into the settings, and if you scroll down, you will be able to find delete browsing data. Make sure that you include cookies and other permissions, downloads, and so on, and delete everything. This can help clear corrupted or outdated data in your browser's cache, which can be causing errors. Next, try using a different browser. So if you are on Firefox and you have a Samsung device, for example, try using Samsung internet. Alternatively, try using Chrome and so on. If the problem still persists, you can try something like incognito mode. So every web browser should have some form of incognito mode, and this can help you see if the problem is associated with you on the main website. Besides this, troubleshoot your network. Make sure that your internet connection is active and working. If you can, try using mobile data periodically just to see if the problem is associated with your home network. Sometimes the website or service that you are trying to access could be blocked by your ISP. Next, if you are using a VPN or proxy, make sure to disable it. And if you can, switch networks or even restart your router. Besides this, there's not much else that you can do. So I hope I was able to help you. If this video helped you, please consider subscribing. As you can see, 83% of the people watching our videos are not subscribed. By subscribing, you can help us make higher quality videos. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.